Good day guys, thanks for visiting Richard's Corner. My name is Richard and today we've got kind of a vlog, kind of a short haul to share with you guys today. Um, the reason why it's partially a vlog is because we reached another milestone together. Thank you again for all of my viewers and all of my subs uh, for helping me reach 5,500 views. So thank you so much. Uh, we broke 5,000 views not long ago and uh, the ironic thing that I find interesting about my channel right now is that I'm finding a little less time to be able to post to you guys. So I apologize to that because at a vlog entry a long time ago, I said I was gonna go to do daily videos if I could and uh life is not letting me do that <laughs> and i know that other content creators understand the struggle that um when uh, my life outside of YouTube gets busy, I have less time for this. But I, I still enjoy uh, sharing this content with you, so be rest assured that even though I'm not uh, posting as frequently, that I'm still out and about here on YouTube. And uh, so I'm, I'm really happy to share a Saturday video with you guys today. So thank you again for your patience and thank you for helping me reach this milestone. I cannot do this without you guys. So we have some new subscribers on board with Richard's Corner. Thank you for joining uh, recently and uh, thank you for all the comments constant viewers like the, the the regular subscribers that have also been coming every day uh, or to every video thank you for all of your comments and support it really does uh, speak to me and again it does continue to drive me forward on this YouTube journey that I get to share with you guys so thank you so much um, that I, I get to continue to do this without it falling completely on deaf ears <laughs> so thank you so much um, usually I do uh, a tag video but today I'm gonna mix it up because I was really excited to find these items uh, through a thrift means I actually found uh, this this uh, range trooper which was just released yesterday uh, for the new Han Solo uh, uh, Star Wars story that's coming out uh, next year I think uh, but I mean it's a new uh, pop uh, uh, stormtrooper so I'm really really pleased to get that and I found this a brand new sealed copy of uh, Star Wars the last Jedi on blu-ray for you won't believe how much I pay for this I'm gonna get into that in a bit so again thanks for tuning in and now if you haven't visited Richard's corner before if this is your very first video thank you for visiting and the idea of my channel is usually thrifty collecting so I try to show you how you can save uh, finding your favorite toys books uh, movies and video games at far below retail by helping by by helping you shop and save the thrifty way so uh, I found the the, uh, the Star Wars Last Jedi Blu-ray on the Facebook Marketplace and I did pick up the Range Trooper at my local EB Games. So uh, although um, the EB Games uh, purchase doesn't seem like a thrifty uh, kind of um, purchase, uh, I think that uh, if I show you some online pricing for an international seller, you might see, oh, maybe it is. <laughs> but uh, I'll explain it to you in a moment. So thanks again for visiting Richard's Corner. Thanks again for helping me reach a new milestone in my channel. And let's take a closer look at these two items that I found today. So as you can see, we have everything laid out here. Now, usually whenever I do a big thrifty haul, uh, I usually divide the cost of um, the haul package uh, by the number of items in the haul and I usually walk out getting you know all of the figures for about 20 to 30 cents per and uh, t today it's obviously a unique case because I paid about $13 for this and about only $15 for for this so um, altogether I spent almost 30 bucks and uh, that seems a little high for what I usually shop for however uh, when I compared it to the online pricing uh, current pricing even for the retail for the uh, for the uh, last Jedi blu-ray uh, I'm actually walking out super ahead and I will explain the stories behind each right now so I'm gonna start off with the last Jedi blu-ray now I bought this from a really nice uh, elderly lady and gentleman who apparently won this in some sort of contest <laughs> So, and I swear to goodness, their 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 original Blu-ray listing on on the Facebook Marketplace uh, listed this for twenty dollars. I thought that was a really good deal because on um, uh, on Walmart uh, .ca and on even on Amazon, uh, the price range is either between twenty five and forty dollars for this exact same copy, the multi-screen edition of Star Wars. So I was really really pleased that I was going to get it for twenty. And then he says, "Oh, I got to get you change for your twenty. And it's like, "What are you talking about?" It's like, I thought it was a $20 listing. No, 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 it's 15 <laughs> It's like, oh, okay. <laughs> so it's like, okay, well, I'll take it for 15 And I, I just want to show you guys that it is sealed still. Oh, my goodness. I'm so, so pleased because that means the digital copies on this. And I can uh, also download this onto my phone. So I'm really, really super happy. I'm actually going to open it up. 
and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna take a little slit out of the plastic here and, and, and show you what's inside so yeah this this nice uh, couple sold it to me for $15 and I said well why are you gonna give it to me for $15 and they go well we want it that's one and two we're not really movie buffs <laughs> And I said, oh, okay, well, that's nice of you. So I'm just going to, sorry, I'm just going to cover the digital co movie code, obviously, but there's the digital code for, uh, for, um, for my Last Jedi copy. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to enjoy that. And it looks like here I've got a bonus uh, Blu-ray here, and I've also got the actual um, movie right there. So beautiful presentation. I love the... Um, I love the printing on it. Uh, interesting choice to have Kylo looking over his uh, his army from the observation deck there uh, before he connects with Rey via the Force again. And this is our our new director for this movie, and you can sort of see him talking to the actor behind C-3PO. So a really nice. Um, presentation pretty simple uh, I can show you the extras here that are included um, we get uh, the full-length documentary about uh, the uh, the making of we got 14 deleted scenes we have the balance of the force which is a nice little featurette uh, Andy Serkis who also played um, Gollum in the Lord of the Rings trilogy he plays um, Snoke and uh, there's two scenes from the movie featuring him uh, with uh, some on-set performances there then there's also uh, scene breakdowns the lighting um, for the space battle Snoke and the mirror uh, and um, snow and mirrors for pardon me and then the showdown on crate which is really cool which is the salty uh, sand planet and then we also have audio document uh, commentary throughout by Ryan Johnson the director uh, of uh, for so uh, sorry of uh, last Jedi so really nice um, uh, captures of the uh, of all the cast there Ray is uh, plays such an awesome part in the movie she's just a kick-ass character and uh, I, I have a crush on Daisy Ridley because of it and uh, yeah no this is just an awesome awesome addition to my movie collection I cannot wait to download this to my uh, phone and also uh, watch it on my big screen uh, really really awesome to find Last Jedi uh, from the Facebook marketplace for a whole $15 uh, a real good steal I think uh, for Richard's Corner for sure so with the new Han Solo movie, uh, Solo movie coming, haha, <laughs> that's actually kind of funny, the Han Solo Solo movie. <laughs> Uh, this is one of the characters from uh, that um, new movie. Uh, this is called a range trooper, and it's kind of an interesting um, uh, to 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 learn about them. You can sort of see that they've got sort of a, an interesting um, a uh, an interesting outfit uh, they've got like fur on on their shoulders so it almost looks like a snow trooper uh, they've got these really heavy duty boots uh, the mask is very reminiscent of death troopers from uh, rogue one so although this is like a prequely kind of movie it's interesting that they're giving a new take on all the troopers uh, so they are uh, and they are armed with a similar uh, blaster that uh, the current stormtroopers uh, from both force awakens and even in the original trilogies the e11s they are um he's equipped with that so I am going to unbox this um, although a lot of uh, pop collectors prefer to keep uh, their boxes or their pops in box and never really le see the light of day outside of them uh, I prefer to uh, share it with uh, with you guys as well as sort of have a, have it held in my hands feel it here so this is a, a real bobblehead you can see the spring so you do have to take a little bit of, of care when you handle uh, pops of this nature because some um, pops like the Mr. Bean pop in the background here uh, they uh, um, they have a fixed head versus this one having the more loose spring head. But I, if I bring it up closer here, you can sort of see. I love what what really draws me to this particular trooper is the gold uh, visor, very much like the um, um, uh, Master Chief uh, visor that uh, is in Halo there. But I love this hybrid kind of like it's like it's like a, a snow trooper kind of thing. It's very cool, but with the fur, which is really cool, uh, it almost seems like a, a sniper kind of outfit, you know, like trying to be camouflaged and everything. So really cool detailing in the boots. You can sort of see the extra diodes and coloring that they put into these really tiny, tiny feet. <laughs> and the oversized head just drives me crazy. So that's really fun. Now I paid a whole uh, $13. Uh, it's a little bit less than normal retail because I have the Edge membership at EB Games. Uh, and it gives you 10% off. So before tax is about 11 something, after tax is about 13 something. And I'm actually surprised that on eBay, there's actually somebody trying to flip it from um, uh, 
Italy <laughs> for about $27 before any kind of shipping. But it really still is available at retail, guys. I mean, like, it, it just got released, like, literally yesterday, Friday. So um, if you uh, are a big fan of the Stormtroopers like I am and you want to add to your Trooper collection, this is definitely an awesome addition. Much like my Death Trooper that I picked up uh, not long ago, I'm really happy to find this Range Trooper. So a very unique take on the Stormtrooper here. To finish off the haul, an awesome Range Trooper uh, giving you a preview of what they look like for the new Han Solo movie coming up. Uh, that's to finish the haul. <laughs> So this is Richard from Richard's Corner signing off for now. It is a short haul. And again, it is just a shout out to you guys for helping me reach another milestone, 5,500 views. Uh, again, my journey here cannot happen without you guys, my awesome viewers. So thank you for all of your love and support for this channel. All of your likes, your comments, your subscribes, uh, whether you're new or old to this channel, thank you so much for sharing in my journey with me. And uh, I have this pleasure of, of sharing all these awesome finds with you. And I'm so grateful for your interest in this channel. It, it will continue to drive me forward on this journey. Uh, for now, it is Richard from Richard signing, uh, Richard's Corner signing off for now. I'm going to wish you happy hunting and happy collecting. And I hope that all of your finds, whether they're retail, thrifty, or otherwise, I hope they are all equally awesome. Please hit like and please hit subscribe if you haven't already and stay in touch with me so you know what is new and happening here on this channel. And also hit that little bell icon so you're instantly notified when something new has been uploaded. Uh, I so appreciate you visiting today, guys. Stay tuned for more. I've got an overflow marketplace video that I still have to get ready. I've still got a ton of hauls from uh, Scope Incorporated, from Value Village, from uh, Goodwill, from Salvation Army. I've got tons of stuff to show you guys and very little time to show you. So I hope you'll be patient and continue to check out the channel in the meantime. Thanks again for visiting, guys. It's Richard signing off for now. Let's see you next time. Thanks for visiting Richard's Corner, guys.